Hey everybody, it's John here from The Nice Guys. Super quick announcement. We are coming up on our one year anniversary of the podcast, and we want to celebrate with you guys. So come out Friday, November 28th at 8.30 p.m. to Imperial Pub in Toronto. We're going to be doing a full live episode of the podcast, and then we're just going to be hanging out and having drinks. Come on out and join us. Now here's the episode. That's how I remember it. That's how I remember it. <laughs> I'm just a little girl. <laughs> <laughs> Got rid of that mosquito. Oh, no. <laughs> you seen this movie? <laughs> Y'all got any uh, apple juice? <laughs> My lady business is tingling. Call me Batman! <laughs> bang, bang, bang! <laughs> Woo, Sally's dead. No! The Zoltar machine in the corner of the room. <laughs> hey, everybody, look at that. This is what I call the dino rap. <laughs> I sure am Chinese. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, I just got that now. Hello, and welcome to That's How I Remember It. We are the nice guys. I'm John. Mike. Raul. And uh, we are actually in the old Nice Guys Clubhouse, which is to say my mom's basement, which these guys have never been to. We're at uh, the Ottawa Improv Festival. Woo! And Woo. we ran into our good <laughs> friends Darcy and Bingley, who Woo. are Chris Levier and Robert Hills. Yeah! yeah. That's us! That's uh, the two of us! Two great friends of ours from Toronto, and we decided, hey... We're drunk. We're drunk. <laughs> we have a microphone. Why don't we go sit in uh, a stranger's basement? Every <laughs> stranger to everyone but me. Surrounded by Nerf weaponry. Surrounded by <laughs> so that's much. No joke. No, that's not riddled with Nerf. There weaponry. are yeah. four Nerf swords, one Nerf axe, one Nerf. Are you four? I, I, bet, I, think, <laughs> you're under, I think you're four. I think you're undercutting. Uh, yeah. Those are just the tall ones. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, no, guys. I'm only talking about the Nerf brand. There's ones. some axes really beneath. The, oh, there's, shit. A, there's axes Sorry. beneath this table. <laughs> Sorry, this glass table actually has two extra Nerf axes inside the table. <laughs> I like that you're not counting off brand so Oh no, I'm <laughs> only counting Nerf. Specific. There's a Nerf mace. Uh, the, the shield over there that's broken. We just determined earlier today. The reason it's broken, not Nerf. Oh, some off brand thing. Yeah. Quality. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You pay for what you get. You get for what you pay. That's yeah. true. Uh, <laughs> Kmart. Uh, so we are, we're obviously, we're going to have Chris and uh, Rob back on the podcast separately as, as guests in the future, but we found them, we want to hang out with them, and this is happening, so listen to your ear holes, make it so. Yeah. Well, thanks so much for having us. Yeah. This is, very, this very is great. Much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you, you for, for having this. us. Oh. Our pleasure. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying the wine. <laughs> yes, I'm enjoying it out of my sherry glass. <laughs> With a grape in it. <laughs> a, a large grape. There now, will be a nice picture on the Facebook page of, <laughs> of yeah. Chris drinking his fancy wine. Between you and me, <laughs> this grape looks like the size of a human eye. <laughs> yeah. Between... I believe it's an optical illusion based yeah. on the wine that's in the glass. Yes. But I can't say for sure until I take the grape out and eat it. That's happening at the conclusion of this yeah. podcast. Stay tuned. Or in the middle. <laughs> More, yeah. Whenever it happens. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever I get hungry. Yeah. <laughs> or, or the moment he finishes the wine. Yeah. So uh, we're gonna do our. We're gonna have a few drinks during this episode. I hope you enjoy spending time with us because we enjoy spending time with you. Hi. 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 <laughs> John did not expect that. <laughs> I'll be but we're, we're not going to go crazy as we did with John Amir. We're not going to go crazy as we did with Haley Kellett. We're not going to go crazy with drinking as we did um, in the long lost Child's Play episode that you will never hear. So what? what? <laughs> no. What? That was what? What I want. Who was, who was in it? Was it just you guys? It or? was me, Mike, and Shargel. There was also an episode that we recorded while drinking wine on my bed. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, there was three of us in the bed and John was sitting beside the bed and it was just a drunken mess and that 
we'll never be heard ever. In the and world. Uh, it was Lord of the Rings, by the way. It yeah. was Lord of the Rings. We we may do Lord of the Rings in the future, oh, but sure. that that version is never happening. <laughs> And, uh, the bed-based version. But if you guys want to come to Toronto and visit Mike's apartment, his bed still has wine stains. Wine stains. <laughs> wet stains? <laughs> yeah. Wet, oh, it got wet crazy. Yeah. <laughs> so we've set the bar for tonight, yeah. guys. We gotta, we gotta be. Yeah. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna try and keep it a little bit in check, but we're still gonna have a good time with you. Hi. 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 We did it. <laughs> Me and Robert so... just stopped at the exact same time. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Pr- I'm proud of us. Yeah. We're already in group mind. Yeah. That's improv. Mm. Yeah. That's yes improv. And. Yes and it. Is that all right? Um, <laughs> what? My understanding, Darcy and Bingley. Yes. Darcy, Chris Levier is choosing the movie for us today. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, great. So tonight, uh, we're going to see or do uh, how we, how we remember. Child's, uh, nope. nope. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're That's exactly. <laughs> That's what we said. Uh, problem Child. Do you remember Problem oh, Child? Oh my god. Oh, that's god. a great one. That's yeah. a John Ritter vehicle? Yeah. John Ritter. Yeah. And, oh my god. Is Gil- Gilbert god- god- Godfrey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a main is he character. just in the second one? I've no, never no, no, seen no, it. No, no, no. He's in, in the first one. He's, he's in, in all. all of... He is the through line. Yes. Yeah. For the entire Child's Play. Uh, through one, two, Problem and Child. the... Problem Child. <laughs> God. <laughs> Problem Child. He is the through line for the entire yeah. Problem Child uh, series. Much and... as Eugene Levy became the through line for every American Pie movie. It's true. Oh, oh my God, God. he's yeah. the only one. How many Problem Child movies? There's only two or there's more? No, there's, there's two. Uh, uh, there's at least three. There's, yeah. There's two with the, the original kids. Two with the original kids. And then like the third is the off-brand one. Yeah, like Home Alone. Where yeah, they got exactly a new what kid. Yeah. What yeah. other actors are in Problem Child? Uh, John Ritter. Ritter is the father. Uh, Michael Richards really? is in the first really? one. Oh. Uh, he's the uh, killer. <laughs> what? <laughs> I know you're right. You're right. I just yeah, did a legitimate spit take. <laughs> There's a killer in Problem Child. Yeah. I, <laughs> I, I, you, I, go for it. Yeah. No, I vaguely remember it. I don't remember the details, but I do remember him being in there. <laughs> There's a killer. And it's Michael Richards. <laughs> Oh my God! I do remember yeah. what movie was it had. He's still, there's there's a child chil, children's movie. There's a child's movie that has uh, Christopher Lloyd as like a a, a wandering stranger a killer. Oh, that's what I'm thinking of. Back to the Future. Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, <laughs> a wandering stranger. Oh my God! Killer. No. Christopher Lloyd terrified me in Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Yeah, Robert. those eyes. Oh, yes. yeah. 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 Oh my yeah. God. Yeah. I mean, do you and a cartoon. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it was he terrifying. just wanted so, to build some freeways. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> guys, what's so bad about that? Yeah, know, and right? with some the traffic freeways. we have going on today, don't you wish we had more yeah, freeways? I know. Yeah. Freeways, freeways, freeways. So, Who <laughs> Framed Roger Rabbit is the movie we're doing today. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Oh uh, no, we're doing Problem Child, and I I feel like it's only fair to do Gilbert Gottfried as the impersonation. Oh God, that we need to. <laughs> oh my God! To see <laughs> oh my play. God! And by the way, it is one in the morning. My mother is asleep upstairs. <laughs> oh God! And we're gonna do Gilbert Gottfried yeah. at the top oh, of our God. lungs. Is this gonna be like waking up Alex, where we're gonna hear? Her, yes, uh, <laughs> waking hear up her having movie. a shower. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, Rob, you have to not listen to so many podcasts. I listen to you guys. I was saying earlier, I, I legitimately listen to this podcast. And we legitimately yeah. love you. He was it. telling me in the bookstore earlier today <coughs> how lovely he, uh, or how much he enjoys your lovely podcast. Mm-hmm. Thank you. It's, it's very true. Oh, I, I, I think the only thing I can say to that is, hi! Hi! hi. <laughs> bye! <laughs> oh, bye! Uh, great. Gilbert Godfrey. Right. Not Dibs. Dibsy's not first. Well, then you're going last because we go clockwise. Okay. Okay. And John's I, first. I, John's I'm, first. Wait, clockwise. I need to remember what it sounds like. <laughs> it's in the direction of a clock. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I understand where I'm at. <laughs> I'm like, what? I love, I gotta say, I love that, that, that Chris keeps filling up his wine, tiny wine glass, yeah. but never when it's empty. No. <laughs> it's it so never com- small. It's never completely full. He may have not have drank it and just kept filling it more and more. I think he that has way, three sips and he fills. If I don't fill it when it's empty, 
then it's not a new glass. That's right. He, uh, he's only had two glasses of wine today. It's genius. <laughs> Welcome for that tip, those at home. Yeah. <laughs> Alcoholism a problem? <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> Fill up your glass. One glass of wine. Uh, Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> oh, God. Ah, fuck. Yeah, that's all. Hey, is this you? Okay. Hey, you kids. Uh, get off my lawn. This is not him at all. <laughs> this is just gravelly. Just gravelly voices. That's so, there's so much anger in that voice. <laughs> Let me yell you a problem. Oh, He's the good. thing. I... I'm an owl. No, what was he in Aladdin? <laughs> what was he in Aladdin? Not an owl. He was like, a parrot. Was, that, was it a parrot? He was yeah. a parrot. He's right. Iago. Iago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had a like round nose. Yeah. In my mind, I thought Iago was a form of a bird. Like it was oh. a type of bird, like an owl or a parrot. Well, that's because you be. weren't literary as a child. Uh, it's from Shakespeare. Oh. I knew that, but I thought the Shakespeare guy was named after a bird. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, also, I'd like to point out that I made a hand motion when you said Iago, which I thought, oh yeah, no, this is Iago. Which <laughs> essentially looks a like claw. a claw. Yeah. A hand claw. Which, if you put it on a table, it would look like it was a spider. A, yeah, a dis, uh, a terribly uh, like asphyxiated spider. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so that was Chris's Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> I hope I get Gilbert. Brilliant. <laughs> Just observational comedy. I made hand <laughs> gesture. That was, whole, that was all Gilbert Godfrey's whole shtick, right? I'm perfect, pretty perfect sure. Podcast material. It's gonna be great. Right. Um. Yeah, so... Actually... Oh, was that it? What? <laughs> was that your Gilbert Gottfried? Oh, what? Oh, your no, next, my, yeah, here Oh, my Gilbert Gottfried? Yeah. Uh, it's, uh... Eh, what? Hey, guys, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's my Gilbert Gottfried right there. So good. <laughs> I was happy with it. Nailed I, it. I go so far to say grand. Oh, oh thank you. Thank splendid. you. You know, I had a dream one time that uh, Gilbert Gottfried and Fran Drescher had a baby... Oh, and then God. its baby, whenever it cried, it would kill people. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like the sound would like like make people's ears bleed off. Uh, yeah, that makes sense to me. That, sounds like yeah. a fact. <laughs> that doesn't sound yeah. like a dream at all. All right, Raul. All right. What do you what do you, what do you have, do you Mr. Man? I fucked her in the ass, and then I gave her another hand, and then he could, goes to the party. <sighs> That's terrible. Yeah. No, that's really good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm genuinely yeah. impressed. Yeah. I, I actually remember who Gilbert Gottfried is now. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He is not. He is not what I thought. No, he's not. What I, thought. Uh, I didn't my... know Gilbert Gottfried until I heard you. Talk. Yeah, yeah. Oh, then and I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you saw Mike's face before he talked. <laughs> I'm Gilbert Gottfried. <laughs> I was in problem, child, and I played the principal, probably. <laughs> <laughs> a young boy once saw the movie in the movie theater, and he tried jumping over a velvet rope. Then he tripped on it and landed on his knee, and it hurt for weeks. That was me. <laughs> My favorite part about that impression is that uh, I feel like Gilbert Gottfried starts every sentence with, I'm Gilbert Godfrey. Yeah. yeah, that's how you know that it's a, a bad impression is coming. Because no impressionist has to tell you who they are when they start yeah. their impression. Yeah. Yeah, no. Oh, I am John Travolta. I also, I also like the idea that this Gilbert Godfrey isn't completely aware of what he's done. In film. Yeah. I, maybe didn't I don't know. I just showed up and they gave me a check. Yeah. You had your chance, John. No, no, that, no that's, <laughs> that was that second round was pretty good. Oh, oh my tears! I love, I love you. Raul makes fun of me because he knows that I'm a better man. <laughs> <laughs> all, he's just jealous <laughs> argument. Oh, oh, snap. Oh, yeah. snap, snap, snap! All right, oh that's my all god, that. there are so many weapons. Take it in. Anything can happen. Yeah. We're going Thunderdome, guys. <laughs> um, <laughs> ah. I make a living by being abrasive. I'm Gilbert Gottfried. I'm not gonna 
going to be able to maintain this. <laughs> <laughs> That's sad because it's good. It's not bad. Oh. Oh, no, you maybe can. I can. I, I, I have faith no, in I can feel I your pain. That's, I have faith yeah. in me. It's utterly hurt. Oh, it wasn't pleasant. And um, saliva came into my throat to protect my future. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was my body trying to yeah, protect maker. myself from my brain. How does Gilbert <coughs> Gottfried survive in the world speaking like that? I have genuinely well, no idea. He walks off stage and he's a gentle, personal man, right? Yeah, mm-hmm. he, Gilbert Godfrey probably just yeah he probably just talks like this yeah. and he's, like, oh, yeah, he's probably yeah. like an operatic singer yeah. in his free time yeah remember when I did that joke about 9-11 and people thought it was a little too soon because it was that day it, was, it wasn't 9-11 <laughs> it was the uh, typhoon yeah it was the I typhoon. lost all my sponsorships no no but he did 9-11 remember uh, I think you're right in um, uh, on one of the roasts oh did he he did 9-11 the week of oh Jesus and then that's when that's when uh, Aristocrats got famous because he did the 9-11 joke and the room got quiet and then he was like, all right, I'll tell you another joke. And he just told aristocrats. Okay. The, only the reason, reason he lost his job was the typhoon thing. Oh, yeah. yeah. He had, like, yeah. second chance, I think. Oh, yeah. He doesn't like, give a shit. Yeah. He's a, he does not give a shit. <laughs> well, he probably sleeps in, like, a Scrooge McDuck-style pile of money. Yeah. yeah. I, I assume he's still... Swallowing nails. <laughs> Swallowing nails. <laughs> yeah. 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 Like gotta, that, yeah. gotta keep, gotta keep just, it up. Just <laughs> nibbling yeah. on, uh, on sandpaper. <laughs> yeah. uh, but I imagine the residuals from, like, Aladdin and then the Aladdin TV show <laughs> oh, yeah. are probably just making him keep rubbing himself with dollar coins. Uh, what about Aladdin 3, show? King of Thieves? Yeah. Holy yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy. Do you he remember did... that? It was like yeah, two or three the... seasons. It was a good show. But yeah. I mean, like, yeah, it was a good Disney show. had a weird run of like they did two seasons of every show yeah like and they just decided we're just doing two seasons so we can keep up the quality i guess Timon and even had one what, home improvement, home improvement? Home? no timon and pumba oh. Oh. Home home yeah. improvement. i heard home improvement yeah the animated thought, feature the animated yeah feature. jonathan thought... taylor thomas was so great as simba <laughs> <laughs> let's take his second greatest role and animate it <laughs> <laughs> let's take it because lion king was live action as yeah. it was I'm super proud of myself for knowing that the kid from Home Improvement was the lion. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, wow, that's right. But but it was only the youngest lion. That, and he yeah. didn't sing. He, they got somebody else to do the singing. Yeah. Did they? That's yeah, a yeah they did. They used to do that in Disney all the time. They, they still do. Is. They did it in Frozen. Pocahontas. Oh, was it? Oh, yeah. yeah. Matthew Broderick was the voice of the older lion as well. Yes, yes, he was. Which I did not realize until I was older and watching the movie. Yeah, going, I, I had to be Who do I know this yeah. guy? Oh, my God, that's a guy from Inspector Gadget. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> His other classic. <laughs> <laughs> French Stewart? <laughs> no, you're thinking of Inspector Gadget 2. Oh, oh, oh my wow. God, I saw that. Uh, oh, really? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you should apologize to me about that. You gave people money. <laughs> yeah. Do not no, apologize to us. Apologize to the listeners. Yeah. yeah. You rewarded people for what listeners, they did. Listeners, I'm yeah. really sorry and. Yeah. Bye. 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 How can I stay mad at you? Oh, God. yeah, you're right. Let's come back. <laughs> Bye. 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 Uh, we should probably move on and do a oh movie. Oh my god, that's right. <laughs> We're doing the this King? is a great conversation. <laughs> yeah, this is a fantastic conversation. We should just do a conversation episode one. <laughs> yeah. uh, okay, so we need to move on and do the... the oh, do we didn't pick a person. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's right. We, no, that's we, just, exactly <laughs> we just wanted to compete. <laughs> <laughs> we just like the competitive nature of I, I know he's been winning a lot. I really like Mike's. I like Mike's or Chris's. Uh, can we, I'm going to vote for Mike. Can we combine them? Could we say it's Chris, but he has to take Mike's Mike's uh, tack of saying I'm Gilbert Gottfried <laughs> at the beginning of every set. Yeah. 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 Right. I love this. Uh, great, great, great. I love, I love everything. Uh, right can, now, you can be other characters as well. Yeah. No. Okay. <laughs> or maybe we'll see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> because you know, the still Michael Richards, the serial killer, is oh, still boy. up for grabs. Yeah, and a kid. I gotta figure out what movie Christopher Lloyd is the serial killer that like stalks <laughs> kids in the streets. Oh, stalks that's Home Alone. Kids. Nope. No, he does. He sure does stalk kids. Oh, oh, oh yeah, because he's a... no, 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 no. He's not that's... in Home Alone. No, uh, oh, is it Dennis Home Alone? the Menace. It is Dennis. He the is. Menace. Is. It's Dennis the Menace. Absolutely, Dennis the Menace. That's crazy. I, I do not. 
Really? Yeah. yeah. It's, he's Dennis the, bad the guy. Menace has a bad guy that's yeah, like stalking the kids, yeah. and it's Christopher Lloyd, who's a serial killer. Well, I don't well, know. He, I know. No, he did murders. I think he's he like a, a burglar and a murderer. Oh, yeah. Just and a murderer. <laughs> well, I'm pretty he's sure not a serial. So murderer. it's not pattern. Yeah. He just kills. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Indiscriminate killing. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't have a fetish or anything. Yeah. So he's not some freak. <laughs> Which makes sense in a child's movie, really. <laughs> And then I think Dennis the Menace stops him with a slingshot or something. As he did. Yeah, yeah, something like that. As one would do. I don't remember. And then he makes bad cookies. Oh, Mark Mar- Mar- Matthew Martin Landau wasn't he, uh, Mister? Uh, uh, no, Gabriel? Walter oh, Matthau. Ma- Walter, Walter Matthau Matthau was. What did I say? He said Martin Landau. What is that? <laughs> Martin <laughs> Landau is the guy from who plays Bella Lugosi in, in uh, um, the Johnny Depp uh, Tim Burton movie. Uh, Ed Wood. Ed Wood. Ed Wood. Nailed That's it. Right. Yeah, you got there. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, we're really good at this. Yeah. We're nailing this today <laughs> so far. This is how we remember it. Yeah. 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 Is, is that a helpful, exactly. helpful thing to say? <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. Let's start. With the theme music. With the theme music that we all remember from Problem Child. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hm
That's when the police commissioners win. They cut to the, the shoe repair shop <laughs> down the street. And hey. that's how it happened. The cops just went crazy. What? They must be smoking crack PCP or something. <laughs> they burned down the whole police station. Wow. That's crazy, Biggie. <laughs> no, don't start this. You I know, kids, kid. <laughs> guys. I know where this leads. Trust me. Twenty four. <laughs> we cut to the zoo, and that's how all the sewer pits and down got burned out. They went crazy. They must be. Why am I even telling you, lion? <laughs> Biggie. <laughs> I'm Gilbert Cox. <laughs> I've come to find you, Biggie! Wait, I'm sorry. Where would I know you from? <laughs> oh, I'm the guy who gives orphans to people. To, so that they can have families. You're the only one who didn't die in that orphan fire. You mean, I moved up the list? I'm gonna get parents now. Yep, all the other ones are dead. <laughs> 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 Just to clarify, all the orphans are dead, not the parents. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Lion, don't ruin this for me. This is my big chance. Just uh, shut up, Lion. Uh, yeah, the orphans, they all died in that horrible fire that the police rule as because uh, the police rule what fires are. The police ruled it. <laughs> Tad's a... Sorry. Chris is super committing to the Gilbert Godfrey face. He is having spasms. I love it. Hey, I, it is amazing. It's so good. <laughs> so many tears. I didn't... I 100% didn't remember that Gilbert Godfrey can't keep his eyes open and he just keeps he blinking. Just talks, but God, as Chris is doing it, I'm like, that's what he looks like. <laughs> Oh. Uh, uh, okay, okay. <laughs> the lion expectantly looks back and forth holding a match. <laughs> <laughs> All the other orphans died in that fire that the police ruled was a definite accident. Yeah, before they, they all the police burned themselves. <laughs> yeah, you were the one, the commissioner who, who, who did not die and survived ruled it as an accident. Commissioner Rasmussen? That's the one! Right. <laughs> but So we're all caught up. <laughs> but I've got a family for you. There's one family that wants to test whether or not they can have a real child by taking an orphan. <laughs> I gotta say one more thing. Sorry, out of character. <laughs> you don't have to lean in for Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> <laughs> it's a character choice. <laughs> John. All right, I'm going to just move this slightly. <laughs> oh, <God. coughs> Great. Okay. Okay. Brilliant. So they want to see if they can be good parents. So they want an orphan. You're the only one in the tri-state area. Oh, God. You mean the fire <laughs> spread to Michigan? <laughs> oh, all of Michigan is gone. It's just arid, burnt land now. It only hit the orphans. <laughs> yeah. All yeah. of them. <laughs> the rest of the people are fine. But anyone, <laughs> even the ones who had been adopted, dead. <laughs> and even the people that had grown up. Yeah. 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 Who are now just regular people. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Even, even, right. even the older people, people whose parents had passed away. <laughs> Are dead now. Even people that were on airplanes yeah. just burst into flames at that moment. <laughs> Even graves. <laughs> I told them not to pass that law requiring that all orphans wear kerosene soaked clothes. When will they learn? The government. <laughs> <laughs> well, possibly never. <laughs> I feel like this conversation could go on forever. <laughs> it could. Can I meet those parents you talked about? Well, I've got the let's 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 cram you in a suitcase and take you over. I'm sorry. To clarify, you're clam. I'm I'm putting you in a suitcase. <laughs> no, I'll put you in a suitcase, Biggie. Your Tully, Biggie. What's your name? No one's ever asked me my name before. Well, tell it to old Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> it's Stephen. Stephen. Yeah. Do you got a last name, Stephen? St 
Steven Problem. <laughs> but trust me, I'm not a problem, child. Wink. Sparkle. <laughs> All right, Steven Problem. Hop into my carry on. Okay. Zip. You don't fit in here. I can't close the carry on. Could you just buy another seat on the plane? Or... Fine. <laughs> and he didn't. <laughs> the, Stephen Problem is just riding on the wing of the plane. William Shatner is staring out on the wing and banging on the glass, trying to point out the There's shot. a monster on the wing! Shut up! Uh -oh. And then besides William Shatner is John Lithgow. <laughs> silently <laughs> crying. <Yeah. laughs> because no one remembers him. Shut up, William Shatner. <laughs> All right. So this is Texas. <laughs> yeah, we landed in Texas. The third of the tri-states. Nope, no, who am I? Gilbert Gottfried. <laughs> Gilbert Gottfried, who's Gilbert lost... Gilbert Gottfried. I'm Gilbert Gottfried, who's lost his first two teeth. <laughs> <laughs> it was a very eventful plane ride. Yeah, the hey. nuts were super hard. I bought... Diet Pepsi. Diet Pepsi. Yeah, I've been waiting for that. <laughs> I forgot about it. I, you asked for a Diet Pepsi... And I thought you wanted to I drink totally, one. I totally. I just wanted to I've drink it. I've been seeing that sit there. Like, I even noticed it at the beginning. I'm like, oh my god, he's going to do <laughs> <laughs> so I funny. completely forgot. I'm supposed to shift Gilbert Godfrey to you. What? What? That never was No, this deal. is okay. We, what? You just had to use his thing where you keep saying oh, Gilbert Godfrey. Am I s always Gilbert Godfrey? Great. Good. Oh, you can be other characters. No, right? I'm you, Gilbert you, Godfrey. I never great. Ah, oh, great. We've landed in Texas. Just to clarify, when we talked before about the tri state area, it was Michigan, <laughs> Texas, and Alabama. <laughs> the three, the three <laughs> bordering states. states. <laughs> yep. America. The three that bordered Texas. Wink. <laughs> well, Sparkle. now that we've landed here, I sent word to the parents to uh, meet us at the airport. You don't have to narrate. We could just meet the parents. Yeah, no. we're, actually, we're actually here. Yeah, I'm here. We're here. Yeah. Hold on for a moment. Okay, we'll wait. We have to meet the parents. <laughs> is, we're right here. Yeah, I, I just want to love you. I... I could, I could go for some love. I mean, we want, just want to test you out to see if yeah, we can have a real kid. Hey, trust me, guys. I'm not going to be a problem, child. Kids, Wink. Hey, just to, before oh, we take you. Okay. Yeah, you've said that a couple you, times. It's a can... little question. What, what happened to your real parents? Why do you guys know what I... What said? happened to your real parents? What happened? Ah, he shakes. The, the screen goes all watery. And we zoom into his eye. And we see him as a two-year-old. Hey, hey, little guy. Oh, how's it going? Oh, he's so cute. And he's ours. He's ours now. We made that child. Oh. Wink. <laughs> Wait, is he asking us to revolt? What? Uh, oh, should we? What's he want us to do? I think revolt. Well, I think I, that's true. That's true. The yeah. government does not deserve our tax money. No. <laughs> Burn this place to the ground? <laughs> Well, I, I I just happen to have a package of matches that I got last night from the drinking club. And I covered myself in kerosene because I was going to kill myself earlier. <laughs> uh, suicide pact? Suicide pact. Great. Great. <laughs> and that's what happened to my parents. It's like they went crazy. I think parents are smoking crack PCP or something. Wow. Well, that's... I'm Gilbert Godfrey, and I think that's great. Great. So if I could just get my check. <laughs> what? For the child. You just go around finding kids. <laughs> yeah, just to be clear, I didn't ask to see any identification or nothing. Yeah, I'm actually kind of confused about the nature of our relationship yeah. right now. And that, that squinting thing... <laughs> It's suspicious. You and do you know. know that Michael Richards just standing in the corner? Is he with you? <laughs> no, he's completely... We're not together at all. No? 
Well, not officially, no. Michael Richards is wearing a top hat and carrying a cane. He is also carrying a second top hat and cane. With a sad puppy dog look, he tries handing them to Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> no, no, not now, Michael. Not now. Pretend I'm someone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're Lawrence. You're Lawrence for this one. Didn't we pay the adoption company? <laughs> and now you gotta pay the piper <laughs> we who brought you a child. Okay. We did pay the adoption company, but I mean, we can't d- deny results. I mean, there's That's a child true. here on this airplane. That's true. Yeah, and I for sure don't have parents because I remember that thing. Agreed. <laughs> no, not yet. <laughs> no, no. Okay. Whenever you want to, Michael Richards, you just <laughs> yeah. jump in. Yeah, maybe, Michael Richards, maybe you'll find some place someday where you could just walk in haphazardly and just start talking. I'm sorry. But that place isn't here. Michael Richards hits play on a, on a ghetto blaster but beside him and, and putting on the Ritz starts flying. By talking. And only that part of the song. <laughs> was there, was there a point to that, Michael Richards? Or? I don't know. I, I really don't know. I liked it a lot. I thought it was had something to do with the top hat and the you? cane. Uh, what? Can we adopt you, Michael Richards? He is quite well, handsome. No, guys, no, I mean, no, only if Gilbert <laughs> Godfrey would let me be adopted. Guys, I swear, <laughs> I'm not a problem, child wink. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter to old Gilbert Godfrey who you adopt as long as the check cashes. <laughs> Wait, uh, Michael Richards, if we adopt you, do we have to pay Gilbert Godfrey? Yeah, does he get a cut? I get a cut of all major adoptions. But you just said you didn't know him. How could you now claim that you know him? Yeah, your story doesn't check out, Gilby. Yep. Uh... uh hey, my, my parents are right. Oh, he made us! He said he's talking about us. <laughs> Don't oh, you... my boy. Oh, my about this? Let's adopt both of them. Why? No, I can't stand it. <laughs> I cannot stand in the well, way of true which love. the good child. No. <laughs> How about this? How about we adopt him and they go on a buddy cop adventure together? Well, that sounds like fun. I like this. Me, don't I you dare, know. Michael Richards. Don't you dare, I Michael Richards. I won't know what will happen, but I feel like it will be fun. We cut to a motorcycle. <laughs> it's Gilbert Godfrey. It's in, Gilbert Godfrey is in the sidecar. Yeah. And the problem child, sorry, uh, Stephen Problem is, is driving with an old-timey German helmet with a spike on top. And Gilbert Godfrey's a scar. <laughs> which is nice and white. It's waving in the back. Well, it looks like we're having another one of those days, Gilbert. <laughs> I'm Gilbert Gottfried, and I am very upset that you ruined this for me, Stephen. Hey. What? I'm going to pull over. Why don't you talk about what's really bothering you? I want to know what's going on in here poking your chest. <laughs> You want to know the truth? Yeah. You want to know the truth? Yeah, what, were you adopted? Is that what this is all about? The lines go blurry. (laughs) We zoom into Gilbert Godfrey's head. (laughs) I say we get rid of him. (laughs) Yeah, he's never done nothing for us. What's he ever done for us, huh? Good point, Uncle Frank. Nothing but yell and cry. And... I know he's a dumb little chick. I'm his father, and I or his uncle, and I don't care for him. Yeah, I'm his mother, and I don't like it one bit. I'm his grandfather, and fuck him. I I work at Gypsies. <laughs> hey, Gypsy. I mean, the kid that works at... Do you want to just take us on? It's a restaurant. I'm aware of what gypsies is. We have half-price appies. All right. (laughs) I say we kill this guy, blame the kid for it, and take off on a journey together. Way ahead of you. Or is stabbing the person. (laughs) Good luck, kid. Living a life where you are blamed for murder at two years old. He puts the knife right beside the baby. (laughs) Cut to the courtroom. (laughs) (laughs) The court finds this baby guilty. I'm Gilbert Gottfried. Oh, God, kill it. (laughs) (laughs) Anyone. 
what do we, okay, what do we, is he going to prison? What are we going to do with his baby? He's guilty of murder. Baby Gilford Godfrey. Wait, I'll take him. What? What? Senator Johansson. That's right. I, Senator Johansson, am introducing reform into this legislature that says that all orphans will have to wear kerosene-soaked clothes. So I feel if I'm going to pass judgment on the issue, I should have an orphan myself. Wow, you're the best thing to happen to the tri-state area. Since? Since any, anything. It just sounded like you were going to say... Since sliced bread? Since well, you can say what... I'm, I'm happy with being... You're the best the, thing that's happened ever? since I've been born. I feel like you shouldn't hassle him for more compliments. Four more years... Yeah, oh, actually, you make years. a valid point. Yeah, we you Fuck you. Fuck you for doing it. I like you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I could be wrong, but I don't think senators are four-year terms. You, yeah, well, fuck two, you. Not two not more years. Eight, eight more years. Not much of a eight, eight more years. Eight more years. I'll eight take it. Anyway, come with me, boy. I'll show you the ways of the jungle. <laughs> the jungle. And he did. And zooming out of Gilbert Godfrey's eye, we return to the present day. You went real quiet for like a real long time. I'm Gilbert Godfrey, and I was reflecting. Fair enough. Hey. Wait, how old are you, kid? Ah, boy, you lose track of a lot of time in the orphanage. I know that I was there for four presidents. What is that in... What is that in... How many years does a president serve as a term? Is it two? Two? Is it two? Twelve? Eight? Four? I'm not political. I am an even number of years old. Well... I assume that you had your license to drive us on this motorcycle here. Hey, since I are we on the run or not? What, are you suddenly going to obey the rules? Are we oh, not on the run? Nope. <laughs> Did we break the laws? <laughs> oh, right. Well, we're on a buddy cop adventure, <laughs> yeah. not yeah. a buddy criminal adventure. No, not yet. But well, it there could are go a lot way. of fires. <laughs> 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 and people blame the problem child. They look behind them and they already ran, accidentally run over a person. <laughs> they didn't realize. <laughs> Listen, when I look at you, I see me as a kid. And I had a great influence. The senator. He made me call him the senator the entire time. I had no dad, just a senator. But when I look at you, sure. <laughs> you make me think that there's hope in this world. I'm sorry. This is my attempt at a Kennedy-esque accent. It's uh, not uh, bad. You're being hard on yourself. Am I? <laughs> no, here, am me, I really? Let me join you, Gilbert. <laughs> You're being hard on yourself. We, together, now that we live together, are, are friends. <laughs> And when I come into my own, and I have power, I will... How's that drink? Good? <laughs> it's very good. Hey, what's happening over there? Oh my god! Lions are starting fires! <laughs> <laughs> Before in my life, I've turned a blind eye to fire. But with you by my side, <laughs> shall we not... Bound together and stop this? I think we should. A gorilla is just on fire and crying. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about the logistics of exactly what we're gonna do to stop this fire. And as the camera zooms in, <laughs> we cut to the family that adopted Michael Richards. <laughs> wow, he's so cute. <laughs> Tell us a joke. Yeah. He does these great jokes. Yeah. Uh, Mikey. <laughs> tell us a joke. Yeah, Whoa. tell us one. Hold on. The neighbor Jamal is coming yep. over. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> oh, man. You're that guy from TV. You're funny. Tell me a joke. Tell me that joke. Uh, Come on, man. He's a really good joke. Oh, I love it already. He's ramping up. So what? there's a baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? I'm listening. And then he's oh, going God. to prison. 
Just a second, I got a phone call. What are you talking about? Hey, no man, I'm gonna be there at ten. I'm gonna be ten thirty. I'm gonna be there so at ten thirty. So rude. Just yeah. interrupting oh my his joke. God. I'm gonna be there Who at ten thirty. Well, you a tell Monica that the sorority can wait for me. Oh my God! Do keep I, telling do, the joke. Do yeah. I pick up where I left off? I'm gonna, or do I? Uh, you got. I can oh. leave. I can go for where I left. No, I, just keep going. It's fine. Are you listening? I'm kind. Of, yeah. <laughs> but I feel like you're See, not. We well, care. I'm gonna. I'll pick up the vodka and you. Hold pick on a second, the, Jamal. Hang what? up the phone. I just want to say something, Mikey. You passed the test. What? You showed respect for others, despite the hardships. Yeah, consideration. Yeah, I'm it, not even black. He wipes. <laughs> he wipes makeup <laughs> off his face. He's a tiny Asian man. <laughs> he, the wiping the makeup off made him shorter. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And less athletic. He's a yeah. lot of makeup. We heard a lot of things about you, and we wanted to make sure that. Hey, you learned. He takes off one of his top hats and bows. Oh, you want me to join? I'm sorry, I'm not clear. Do you want me to join you in a song, or are you? No, just... I'm just courteous. He wants you to join him in a song yeah, and you just guys do the sing. song. All right, well, do you have a just... ghetto blaster or something that we could sing? Maybe to you? someone could drop a beat. Oh boy. <laughs> When two men are friends and they reach the end, they will always find respect. And they fight aliens with their laser guns, and they have all the Great. That was beautiful. Yeah, it's I the, have rock can, hard. Can we right adopt now. you, Jamal? I, my no. name's not actually Jamal. What? It's not Peter Ping. It's oh, Peter, Peter Ping. Ping. Yeah. yeah, it's Peter Ping. Oh, I believe yeah. you're a good actor. Well, thank you. I believe that. Thank you. Mom. Uh, uh, thank you. He Mom. bows for four minutes. Mom, Dad, can we have him? Thank you. I want to have him. I want to have him. I'm on board. A uh, thank you. A uh, thank you. Still bowing. Thank you. I'm just gonna presume this to be is to be clear. <laughs> to be clear, he's uh, doffing fake caps and bowing in thanks, not racist bowing. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> What's a racist bow? I just realized. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But people bow <laughs> like that, though. That's a legit bow. No, but I didn't want people to think that I was like, oh, that's funny. He, the Asian guy bows a lot. Yeah, that's true. I'm, that wasn't what I meant. But he is wearing one of those triangle hats. Oh, my God. It's <laughs> fucking <laughs> crazy. And he's, everywhere he goes, he's knee-deep knee deep deep in rice. Straw hats. And, and then we cut back <laughs> to the last racist. Uh, 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 Stephen and Gilbert Gottfried with a charred gorilla by their side and as their new companion. I'm Gilbert Gottfried, and I'm so happy that we were able to save the gorilla, the zebra, and the <coughs> uh, manatee. The manatee, yeah. yeah. Hey, I'm not saying we're superheroes, but I think it's fair to say we're, we're heroes. heroes. Cut to the newsroom. <laughs> Reports are coming in across the tri-state area. Two problem childs are starting fires everywhere. If you see a problem child, please do not approach him. He may be made out of fire. <laughs> report him to the nearest authority. Repeat, report him to the nearest authority. We cut to outside of a television store. What are they talking about? We're not starting no fires. I'm Gilbert Gottfried, and I have not lit a single match this whole time! A man from across the street sees him. Hey! Hey, it's that fire kid! It's that problem child no, I, 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 we're, we're, about. We're not yeah. problem child. We... These guys both light fires immediately. <laughs> <laughs> and burn themselves. <laughs> we can't get caught in this. Not on my watch. <laughs> this is his fault! <laughs> uh, 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 
crispy, crispy, crispy. We gotta get out of here, Gilbert. We gotta go somewhere, somewhere where they're not gonna judge us. Somewhere where, where there's no fire. Somewhere where there's no fire? Yeah. You mean the ocean? Under the sea. <laughs> Under the sea. <laughs> Quick! Hop in the driver's seat, cause I don't have a license. Here we go, submarine one away. <laughs> Seaweed is always greener. <laughs> Somebody is asleep. You dream about going up there. But that, that is a big mistake. mistake. Just look at the world around you. Right here on the ocean floor. Oh, wait a minute. Are you problem childs? Get out of our ocean, man. <laughs> no, I give a god free. I'm an adult. Yeah, and I'm just a little kid or possibly... I don't even know no more. A fish catches fire next to him. <laughs> <laughs> Gilbert, you don't think it's possible it's us, do you? You and me, kid? I mean, it can't be. Can it? Oh, no! <laughs> As they say, oh no, a ball of fire explodes out from their mouth. Expanding and blowing through the ocean. It destroys all of the algae, kill, killing off the entire plant life. Fish and causes it. climate change. Get out of the sea! <laughs> Yo, Somewhere, the fish. Uh, the guy that was supposed to beat George Bush. What's that guy? Al Gore. Al Gore. Somewhere Al Gore. Al Gore. Al Gore. Somewhere Al Gore is crying. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Anywhere that is. Uh, oh no! I'm Gilbert Godfrey, and we seem to be able to set fire, fire to things. things! Oh. Well, like Chris, Chris Evans, Evans in that, that movie! movie. Captain, Captain America! America. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good movie, though. Uh, yeah, I didn't see the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> Which part exactly did you see? Well, I kind of The want... screen goes all wobbly and we zoom in on Gilbert Godfrey's head. Hey, Gilbert. Oh, I love watching movies with you. I'm so happy to just have date night. It's a, such a great thing. Uh, uh, you T. Know. Leone. That's me. <laughs> Tay Leone. That's me, Tay Leone. A door bashes in. What the fuck, man? I'm David Duchovny, and this is no, my wife. No, David, not now. We're watching the <laughs> Captain America. Hey, Captain America is off for the rest of this movie. No, David, he I has don't a care temper. If, I don't care if you've only seen the first seven minutes. You are not watching anything more until we hash this out. Tay Leone pulls out a gun. <laughs> no, not today, David. Points out the TV playing Captain America. <laughs> <laughs> no. You don't mean this, Taya. I will shoot Chris Evans right in the dick. <laughs> no! I will do it. Taya. I will do it. This is a problem between you and me. I've been unfaithful. I've had problems. You drove me into the arms of Gilbert Godfrey. Gilbert Godfrey slowly <laughs> steps backwards out of the house as this argument continues. You drove me into the arms of a loud man. Yeah. We watch Captain America together. I'm aware of what happened. <laughs> the TV <laughs> slowly backs out of the <laughs> <laughs> And now look at us. It's just you and me and this couch left. Hey. Hey. This looks a lot like that couch where... We first met. Yeah. <laughs> Remember that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the screen goes wobbly. We <laughs> zoom into <laughs> tail and he said. <laughs> hey, I, uh... Wait. Are you on that television show um, that's probably going to get cancelled soon about uh, paparazzi? Yeah, that's oh, me, Taylor Oh my Leone. god, I'm on the X-Files. What? Yeah. Are you Gillian Anderson? No, I'm the other one. <laughs> oh, whoa. Hey, you want to go make out somewhere or something? Wow, this reminds me so much of... <laughs> that's the time that I went where I met my ex-husband. 
Oh, I don't. I wasn't aware you were married before. Oh yeah, I was. Oh, I was just gonna ask you if you wanted to make out on this couch, but if you want to think about your ex, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> the screen goes out blurry. We zoom into Tail Leone's head, and she's sitting on a couch with Gilbert Gottfried, her ex-husband. <laughs> so, I'm Gilbert Gottfried. <laughs> I know, you're my ex, you're my current husband, and that's the problem. I can't do this anymore, Gilbert. You're just always. I know your name, Gilbert. Look, I'm Taylioni. I'm gonna be a successful star one day of Deep Impact. Will you? I'm Gilbert Gottfried, and I'm currently a famous star of such movies <laughs> as. <laughs> We zoom out of Tay Leone's head, <laughs> and, then and we see we see uh, we zoom out of Tay Leone's head, and we see her and David Duchovny making out on an old couch. We zoom further out of Tay Leone's head again, and we see the two of them laughing over a couch that looks very similar as Tay Leone holds a gun. We <laughs> zoom out the doorway and out of Gilbert Gottfried's head, and we see him just sitting there reminiscing. You went silent again. <laughs> yeah, you went for like. I'm gonna say four hours. It was so long. I'm Gilbert Gottfried, and I like silence. Gilbert Gottfried's in a wheelchair. He had to push him most of the day. Gilbert, while, while you were out, I had some tests run at the hospital. Is it polio? <laughs> it's like you already knew the answer. Yeah. Taya kept telling me I got polio. I didn't believe her! Yeah. Here's the other thing. I have the rickets. <laughs> and together, it seems like that's given us mental powers. Pyrokinesis. Yeah, it's a control over fire. The doctors were very considerate when they explained it to us. Bottom line is, we can't hang out together anymore. <laughs> what? You're the only thing that gets my life meaning now that I'm so alone. Hey. And you're my only friend, but if we stay together, this world will literally burn. What is more important to you, Stephen? The fact that the world burns? Or that we have family, family. Together. together? You, you and, and me. me. You can hear uh, sirens in the distance. Family. I never thought about it that way. Family. As they say family, a fireball explodes outward from their words and literally engulfs the entire planet Earth. We cut to the spaceship in the sky. <laughs> Where the family with Michael Richards uh, as their adopted son still exists. Because, oh during the part where we missed where they boarded the space shuttle and went up to. It's the, deleted it scene. It was a delete, yeah. deleted scene. Yeah. yeah. Only on the director's cut. Yeah. Wow, that sucks. Mm. Dad? I, Mom? I really like that place. Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. really happy that you guys, you know, adopted me and, and brought me up to to this spaceship. No problem, Peter Ping. Peter hey. Ping. Hey, Peter Ping. No hey. problem, Peter Ping. If I could just say this. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Oh, oh, thank you. Amazing. He's bowing. He's thank doing you. It. You're not racist. Thank you. So no. many hats. Oh, hey. I guess we better start repopulating this species. Oh. All right. He leans in to kiss Michael Richards. A whole new world. Don't you dare close your eyes. A new fantastic world. Hold your breath, it gets better. No one to tell us no. Or let it go. Or say we're only dreaming. As they look out the, uh, the glass of the spaceship, we see the burning planet Earth, and we see uh, superimposed the heads of... Uh, <laughs> we see superimposed the heads of Stephen uh, Problame and, and Gilbert, Gilbert Godfrey. Godfrey. And Gilbert and Godfrey gets one last hurrah. Yeah. I'm Gilbert Godfrey! <laughs> I'm the happiest I've been 
Since my other movies! <laughs> we, uh, the screen goes wobbly, and we zoom in on Gilbert Godfrey as he thinks back on his other movies. And we zoom into his eye, and we see the last scene of his most recent film. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Which one's that? Chasing this Amos. This is Sparta. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I remember it. Yeah, That's how I remember, I remember it. it. Yeah, yeah remember he kicks it. the guy down the well. He yeah. says, this is Sparta. Yeah, that yeah. was his. That was Gilbert Godfrey's yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, for he's sure. Good in his that. finest role. His abs. Oh. Man, they got him cut. Really yeah, worth the 3D. super cut. Absies. Super 3D abs. <laughs> guys, <laughs> thank you so much to Darcy and Bangley. Thank you, guys. No. <laughs> what did I joining... spill all of this on me? <laughs> oh, no. Uh, oh, update. Throughout the podcast, uh, Chris went through an entire bottle of white wine, still has a grape in his glass, and switched to pouring vodka on top of the grape. And goodbye, grape. Oh. Yay. 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 He did it. Note for those of you at home. A poor choice <laughs> is to put a grape in a glass that has both a wine and vodka in it at different times <laughs> and then eat the grape. <laughs> what does that... it uh, taste like specifically? <laughs> vodka. Tastes like the smell of my grandmother. Oh, oh. <laughs> that is specific. Is oh, Nona. No, no. She was a lovely oh, lady. She was lovely, but she loved her vodka. Shit, yeah, she did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She was yeah, ratchet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. I understand what you're implying, and what? I agree. No Stenovia. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was it. We yeah. just had all the fun. Yeah. So we didn't keep none for you. Guys, that, was, that was problem, child. Problem, child. Was it ever? <sighs> the John Ritter vehicle. <laughs> 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 yeah, remember all the John Ritter scenes that we had in that movie? Let's re- think back and remember them. I think <laughs> the I might screen. have been playing John Ritter as I realized only right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, what was I going to say? Guys, do you need to plug anything? Um, uh, like same. I saw on Facebook, Darcy and Bingley, uh, yep. the and symbol is a symbol that's old. Like an ampersand? Yeah, yeah an ampersand, ampersand. yeah. Great. Which is one of our favorite grammatical symbols. It is. Go to 80 slasher flick. <laughs> uh, it's going to be incredibly bloody. Uh, oh, that's actually going to be great. I've been meaning to watch that. Yeah. Uh, we have a lot of friends in that show, and it's yeah, going to kill us. Including... Have, yeah, including us. Uh, although we've been so busy doing festivals, we haven't done the recent ones. But we did the first one, and it was brilliant. It was a lot of fun. It's a lot of uh, crazy, yeah. bloody, like legit bloody. I've seen uh, some great photos of yeah, the aftermath everyone, on yeah, Facebook. Yeah, and oh Everyone my God. loves it. Like the whole concept. Yeah, and it just, great. they keep doing shows on like hey, oh I'm out of town oh I don't want to go like all the reasons that yeah, I- yeah exactly <laughs> um, quick question for those and this may not may or may not make your podcast oh Probably no not. we're doing an hour after the movie stops <laughs> okay <laughs> I imagine that's how this works uh, okay uh, duos top three duos Darcy and Bingley no but I mean oh, well I uh, appreciate it Love it. Uh, and I will In put general? that... That's going to be a pull quote on our, our next history? poster. Great. But top three uh, top three duos in movies. Not necessarily the comedic. Oh. Top oh. three movie duos. Jackie Chan and... Grumpy Old Stucker. Men. Grumpy Old Men. Definitely. Jackie Chan and Grumpy okay. Old Men? <laughs> well, that's what I... <laughs> well, Grumpy Old Men, they did Odd Cup as well. Yeah, like they, they, they're yeah, yeah, yeah. Walter Matthau yeah. and Jack Lemmon. Yeah, they're... they're, they're, they're I mean, if it's uh, talking comedy. There we go. Riggs, Paul Newman and Robert Redford? Riggs and... Yeah. Uh, oh, this thing? Murtaugh. Yeah. Well, they R- did R- other movies Luke? together. Uh, Lethal Weapon. Riggs and Murtaugh? Oh, I've never seen Lethal Weapon. Watch it. You should uh, watch four. I don't know. They're all the same. Watch any of them. Um, Bruce Willis and Reginald Bell Johnson. <laughs> that's, that's, that's great I feel like Bruce Willis and uh, Samuel Jackson is a better choice Maybe than that. Maybe. Okay. If you want for quality, I guess. But if you want for Twinkies. If, if you want for Twinkies and... Um, Wait, I think it's pretty clear Die Hard 1's a better movie than Die Hard 2. Uh, oh. Twinkies is like a I, subplot I, 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 in Die Hard 1. Die Hard 1's a better movie. It's, it's like a subplot in Die Hard yeah. We're just having three conversations at once. <laughs> it's super clear for all of the... All yeah. of we the have songs! <laughs> uh, guys, we hope uh, you listening have also broken into your discussion groups. <laughs> <laughs> this is like Trying a book club for you now. I want to say David Boreanaz and Bones Lady. 
<laughs> yeah. Bones. Oh, from Bones. <laughs> I've never seen the show. But, um, but sorry. I would say, actually, one of my top duos is uh, Fox Mulder. Oh, yeah. And Mulder and Scully. Mulder and Scully. Scully. That's the yeah, other one. Good one. That's the name. That's a <laughs> great duo. <laughs> you didn't say because you just didn't remember. Nope. No Fox <laughs> Mulder. I fully remembered. <laughs> you know what's chose weird? Not to say. Uh, buddy Cop is like one of my favorite genres. Yeah. And I feel like I can't pull... Like, Lethal Weapon obviously sticks out, but yes. I can't pull... Gri- and, like, 48 Hours. Get to old but I can't shit. pull my favorite. What's that? I like, used to watch movies with my old roommate, and, like, any time <laughs> any two characters would, like, make up, or, like, we're gonna work together, Yeah, I would just turn to him and get so excited and shout, BUDDY COP! <laughs> <laughs> and, like, like, clap my hands together, like, here we go, movie's finally taken off. <laughs> so, like, when, when Frankenstein left the frame, and Bud Abbott and Lou Costello would oh. see each other. You would go, Buddy Frank- Cop! Here we go, putting aside the differences to fight Frankenstein's. <laughs> All of the Frankenstein's. Yeah. Kiss, Frankenstein's kiss, monster. Kiss, kiss, bang, bang, Rob Downey Jr. and Val Kilmer. Val Kilmer, Val Kilmer and anybody. Yeah. I, I will... have not seen that yet. What? It's great. It's I great. I own the DVD, but I'm not <laughs> putting my watch. DVD player. You own the DVD player? <laughs> I have an Xbox 360. Which that's yeah, that's what I got function. too. That's what I got as well. Uh, oh, Val Kilmer, I love Val Kilmer and Warwick Davis. Yeah, in, Willow. In what? Willow, that's right. Yeah. yeah, Willow. Willow. Wait, Mad Mardigan. Val Kilmer was in. Yeah, Mad you Mad have not yeah, yeah. seen it. He's the main character. <laughs> yeah. Stop oh, it. I guess yeah. Bond cop, bad cop. Oh, oh good yeah. one. I saw Colm Fiore and. The, the that guy. that the famous French, 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 French the guy that's more famous than Colm Fiore and we don't know his oh, name. Oh, Gerard Depardieu. Well, well, he's in he's in every yeah, yeah, Quebec Marcel, movie. Marcel Marceau. Yeah, Marceau. Yeah. Yeah. He was in Starbuck, which through. they remade with Vince yes, Vaughn. Yes, that's right. Starbuck. Yeah. Starbuck. Yeah. They, they remade it. And they Vince was... Vaughn had a movie recently that tanked called the... Delivery Man. Yeah. It was based on a Quebec movie called Starbuck. Well, but directed by the same director. Weirdly enough. Weirdly. Well, not weirdly. He knew what the Quebec taste was, but just not. The Quebec taste. There's a um, there's a terrible uh, French comedy starring Jean Reno, where he's a knight out of time, and it was a French movie, and it's like oh, he travels it. to the future. Did you it see? Was a and then they remade it as an English one with Christina Applegate. Yep. Same two actors. Exact same thing. <laughs> Just let's get Christina Applegate and talk in English and make the same movie. Yeah, and, and it, it was not go Yeah. No. What um. But that makes me I remember, remember there was this movie Night that was up Night for a uh, Canadian Comedy Award. Uh, and I really want to see it, but I can't, haven't been able to find it anywhere. But it was about these English people who go to this uh, immersive French immersion camp. Hmm. Uh, you know, um, Gavin Crawford was in it. A bunch of English people were in it. Yeah. A bunch of French people were in it. And I thought, this is the perfect movie Oh my god, that represents... Canada. Canada. And do oh they my God. do they like put aside their differences and then like start to work together? I don't know. I only saw like Bye, cop! <laughs> I only saw like <laughs> one and a half minute clips for the CCAs. Fair enough. Uh, but you know what we did not do at the <laughs> end What's of our that, show. Chris? It show hasn't uh, ended yet. I mean, I'm cutting yeah. out 20 minutes of this. <laughs> but, <laughs> With the three conversations I mean, in. <laughs> granted, we do not see serial killer Michael Richards stuff the wife into a suitcase and throw her into a into a truck Whoa. that was carrying pigs and pig feces. What? Did, did that happen in the real... I, that ha- That's not how I remember it. Yeah, I don't but, remember that happening. But... Yeah, you, and then you heard the pigs, like, farting I, sounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you heard what? I hated Problem Child as a kid. That did All not I work out so well, because like I just spat on the Yeah. And what? he, like, pukes on the merry-go-round. That's yeah, my yeah. only memory of the entire and then, movie. And then uh, John Ritter's dad owns, like, the sporting goods store, and Problem Child, like, destroys it. <laughs> that Problem Child. Um, which, which happened in our show. You just may have missed, missed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He also was selling lemonade from a lemonade stand, but he peed in it. I was that that or Dennis the Menace? I couldn't remember. Dennis the Menace Dennis was... The Menace. Uh, no, Dennis the Menace was actually the a nice kid. Same kid. Wasn't it yeah. the same kid? No. The acted in it no. or as characters. Not Dennis the Menace is one of those myth numbers. Uh, the character of Dennis the Menace is like Dennis a nice. Yeah, I did say it weird. 
Yeah. Myth nomer. I'm cutting all this out. <laughs> <laughs> you say so that not, now. Not, yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you it. realize that, really, you only have to, like... Four cuts. Four minutes of good stuff. <laughs> so this, this conversation... No, Dennis the Menace isn't actually, like, a prick. Like, he's kind of, like, a... Good, good he's boy. a good kid. He totally boys, he just, boy, boys will be boys. He, boys will be boys. It was yeah. the, the the neighbor was the one that kind of thought he was a menace. What was the neighbor's name? Mr. Wilson. Well, that and the Dennis? guy who babysitted him. Baby sat him. Baby sat him. Mr. Wilson. Totally babysitted him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. You know, totally babysitted him. Totally babysitted him. Uh, no, 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 I'm telling the truth. <laughs> he babysitted him. I hate you. He did, he did. <laughs> Rightfully so. <laughs> um... But Fuck. yeah, but you I were making say, a point. I was making a point that, despite the fact that we may not have seen, you know, the wife get t- crammed in a suitcase by Michael Richards and tossed into a uh, uh, truck, truck carrying yeah. feces, we may not have seen uh, Pablo Child destroy a sports house. A sports house, <laughs> you know, a house of sports. Um, we have seen the full true, uh, the full true emotional conclusion. Yeah. And that can only end with one way. Bye. Bye. We love you. Kisses. Feedback can be sent to that's how I remember it at gmail.com. And music for this episode is provided by Music Alley by Nibiru.